Well, let's get started. Tell me a little bit about yourself and why you were looking to get started with this program. Well, I am 40 years old. I just had a hysterectomy and a rotator cuff surgeries. Um, so that is a little bit of why I wanted to kind of get started on a, a journey. I have three children. One is grown and I have a grandbaby, but we are on the go all the time. I mean, on my feet, as soon as I my eyes open and until my eyes closed. I know that when we first spoke, you were one of those people where you're like, I'm always going, it's always going. What do I do? Um, yes. Which leads me to my next question. What is something that maybe you were struggling with before working with me? Number one was resting. That <laughs> I struggled with resting and listening to my body. Um, I had the mindset of the more you go, the more, the better it's going to be for you. And I never rested. I didn't eat enough for the amount of stress that was on my body. What are some of the effects that you noticed after you started giving your body <laughs> rest? <laughs> <laughs> well, number one, my mood changed. I feel like I'm in a lot better mood. I feel like when I listen to my body and I give my body that rest, then I don't I'm not stressed out about it. I'm not like, oh my gosh, I didn't get a work in, uh, workout in today. Oh my gosh, I didn't get this. I didn't walk this amount of steps or mm -hmm. the things that I always was like, you have to do this and this and this. If I, now, if I don't get that in, I'm okay with that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I, I, and I feel like it has lifted a lot of stress off of my body. I feel like it has made me to where I'm not as anxious and moody. What would you tell someone who was thinking about joining my program, but was on the fence? Do it. <laughs> <laughs> and no, really, I would tell people that there is no amount of money that you can ever put on the value of your life. Um, I know that there's a lot of people that that's a lot of the reason that they're on the fence is mm -hmm. the money. I mean, let's just be real. We, we're, we live here in America. It's the money. Yeah. Um, that's a lot of the reason that people struggle with committing to something is because they don't want to put that money up front, but there, if you have to look at it as an investment into your quality of life, um, you have to, it, it's an investment into yourself and you would want to give the best to anyone that you love. And I feel like that you should love yourself just as much, if not more than anyone else and take care of yourself. Because if you can't take care of yourself, you can't take care of anyone else. Um, that is it, my biggest advice for anyone. Don't think that you can't do it. Don't think that you can't learn anything. Don't think that you know, oh, I'm, I'm old and I'm set in my ways and I don't, I've tried this diet and I've tried this program and, you know, nothing's ever worked. Mm -hmm. This is something that you have to invest everything into. You only get one body. This is it. And if you don't take care of it, you know, what are you doing? Yep. You, you, you know, and there's a lot of women I know out there that, um, that I myself included when I first talked to you and I was a little bit on the fence about, you know, Oh my gosh, that's a lot of money. And my kids, this, and my kids that, do you know what? My kids see a different me wow. from 16 weeks ago. And my kids would rather me invest that money into my well being, not only physically, but mentally. And I know that my kids would tell me, tell anyone I, I'm proud that she did that. I'm glad that she did that because okay. it, there's, there's so much more to life than just money. Yeah. Um, you know, so that would be my advice to anyone on the fence that it's worth it. You're worth it. Wow. Thanks. That was so mm -hmm. nice of you. <laughs> and I think when we first spoke, your biggest thing was really, you tried so many things in the past. You mm -hmm. were already like trying this whole health journey for so many years and you've tried so many things, but you were still very, very 
very open, mm -hmm. willing to learn. You were willing to try new things and you weren't really ever fighting me on anything. You were like, okay, let's do it. Let's try mm -hmm. it. So I, I thank you for putting your trust in me because mm -hmm. whenever you trust someone that's trying to help you, it mm -hmm. always works out in the end for mm -hmm. both. Um, and I really saw your transformation just within yourself throughout the 16 weeks. Um, and even just, I know you said earlier, just mentally, you're in mm -hmm. a different place. Um, and it's pretty cool to see uh, the growth because you were really determined to continue growing and growing and getting that knowledge when we first spoke. So um, mm -hmm. I had a great time working with you. I think we had a fantastic 16 weeks. Um, and I think absolutely all your kind words. <laughs>